What's up, people? It's Shion from Tech and Games, and I'm here today, and I am about to make a calculator on QBasic now. See, you're in class, and they're teaching you QBasic, and you want to look cool in front of your friends. So what do you do? You go and you learn how to make a calculator, and then you make it in front of them. So that's what I'm going to be teaching you today. So without further ado, let's get into it. Now first, we have to write CLS. Now I'm writing everything in capitals, but you don't have to. Now CLS means clear screen. Okay? Now print calculator. Okay? So now when we start, when we start the whole thing, when we run it, it's going to start up and it's going to show calculator as a print. Now CLS, what it does is, now if we don't have CLS here, every time we're going to start up, it's going to show the previous one. Okay, calculator twice. Do it again, calculator thrice. So we need to add CLS, clear screen, so every time we start from the beginning, it's a clear screen and only what's written there is there. Now, we have to declare number one and number two as singles. So, DIM for declare num1 as single. Then do the same thing. Declare num2 as single. Now, now we're gonna now we need to add a do. So do while rep r e p with a string r e p stands for repeat and that's a string now add these and then it's gonna and then if basically what this is is if you write n when it's gonna ask for a yes or no for again if you write n it's gonna just close the program there now we write input enter first number okay now colon the quotation marks comma space num1 okay now input same thing quotation mark enter now we're gonna write operator Okay, operator means you, the person. Now we're going to make a bracket and we're going to add the four different types of uh, things it's supposed to do. Plus, minus, multiply, and divide. So, plus, comma, minus, comma, multiply, comma, divide. Bracket close. Now, same thing. Colon space quotation mark comma space operator o p e r a t o r again with a string the dollar sign means a string now we're going to add input quotation mark enter second number colon space quotation uh, comma space num two now space now we're gonna start about ifs if I do this then this should happen if I do this then that should happen so first if operator as in us were to x uh, is equal to were to put in the plus sign now the, th the thing we need to understand about QBasic is that it comes pre-installed with plus, minus, divide, multiply, okay? So you don't have to program what they do. So we, quotation mark, then print num1 plus num2, as in number 1 plus number 2. Now we're going to do this for the rest. If operator if operator 
x equal to quotation minus quotation then print num1 minus num2. Again, we're going to add another if, now this time for multiply. So if operator string x equal to quotation multiply quotation then print num1 multiplied by num2 number one multiplied by number two now we're going to do the last one which is divide so if operator string x equal to divide quotation then print num1 divided by num2 now the input now we're going to add an input at the end which it's basically going to be so input again okay again why as in yes or no now remember in the beginning right here we did if we say no it's gonna leave well if we say if we click on y then we're gonna keep going okay so now space quotation comma and then rep string what we did here repeat that's what basically it is okay now rep string x equal to u case string bracket rep string bracket okay and now in the end to finish all this off we are just going to add a loop l o o p loop now with this it should run perfectly so now shift f5 or run and enter first number so let's say 20 let's do plus so 20 plus 15 35 now let's do minus 20 minus 15 5 let's do multiply 5 multiplied by 4 20 now let's do divide 20 divided by 4 5 so as you guys can see it clearly worked and see now we put in an n and it stops so guys thank you for watching please like if you like the video please subscribe please share because that really helps me out and thank you guys peace